Hi guys, welcome to InfoGIS TV. Today basically we'll be bringing you up to speed with the latest in the scheme of things with regards to the Council of Legal Education and its consistent or desire to improve the welfare of Nigerian, student, Nigerian law students across board. So uh, if you're a fan of this channel, you understand that regularly we always bring to you to speed with regards to the construction work that has been ongoing at the Dr. Nabu Graham Douglas campus of the Nigerian Law School, which is situated in Port Harcourt. Um, basically, today's um, update is a very exciting one and um, a mind-blowing one as His Excellency Chief Yen Somerset Wanwiki hosted members of Council of Legal Education in Port Harcourt for the final inspection of the said campus. Governor Wiki and the Council of Legal Education and its delegation, led by its chairman, Emeka Ngigi SEN, were received at the project site by the Honorable Commissioner of Works and Supervising Commissioner Bureau for Special Projects of River State, Dr. Alabo George Kelly, FNIQS. He took them on a tour of the magnificent facility. They inspected the following facilities among its numerous things that the government of River State placed on the campus, a 1,500 capacity classroom blocks, blocks, 1,638 capacity hostel blocks, 1,500 capacity multipurpose hall, 16 units of three bedroom flat staff quarters with swimming pool, gymnasium, lawn tennis court, library, moot court, sick bill, wow, admin, admin block, cafeteria building, store, sporting facilities for students, internal routes, drains, street lights, three power generators of 1,000 kVA each, 2.5 MVA substation dedicated and not just and fire station dedicated a dedicated fire station different from the river state fire um, station and 40,000 liters of uh, water tank governor yes wiki has done marvelously well in his bid to bring river state to limelight governor yes wiki presented Alongside this magnificent facility, a certificate of occupancy of some properties attached, attached to this very building. According to him, he said that legal education, he, he, Governor Wiki welcomed the del, a leader of the delegation, Chief Emeka Ngigwe SCN, to Port Harcourt officially when he began by saying legal education, welcoming the legal educational team for coming to Port Harcourt for the final inspection of the projects. He also wanted to use the opportunity, or he used rather the opportunity to present the certificate of occupancy of those properties I earlier mentioned to the Council of Legal Education and added certain more properties which would generate revenue for the campus. In his remark, the chairman of Council of Legal Education, Emeka Ngigui, SAN, thanked the River State Governor for keeping to his words by building the best in the country as promised. With regards to, remember, uh, the Nigerian uh, the, the Council of Legal Education, which is the body that regulates um, legal education in Nigeria, already has six campuses all over Nigeria, and that is. Um, Enugu, Abuja, Yola, uh, um, Lagos, Yenegua, and so on and so forth. Yeah. So um, in his remark, Chief Emeka Ngigui thanked the uh, River State government and they uh, used the opportunity to also see for himself the um, world class facility that has been constructed for Nigerian law students by the Wiki administration. He said in his remarks, the chairman of Council of Edu Legal Education, Emeka Ngigui, thanked the university governor for keeping to his words by building the best in the country as promised. This is what is amazing me. He said, if you see, we are not shocked by the things we have seen here today. 
then we align. This is amazing. <laughs> is it the seventh wonders of the world? Rebecca <laughs> Ngigi was <laughs> asking a rhetorical question. He said, we laid the foundation of this project in July last year, 2021, rather, sorry, July 2021 last year, and His Excellency promised to deliver the best law school in the country in less than a year. And behold, today is 27th June 2022, and he has delivered on behalf of the council. I am very grateful. Chief Emeka Ngigi said that he was very grateful for the promise made, and it is indeed a promise kept. Also, the Director General of the Nigerian Law School, Professor Isa Hayatu Chiroma, commended Governor Wiki for building the best law school in the country. Like the chairman rightly said, this is the seventh wonder of the world. On behalf of the management of the Nigerian Law School, Professor Hayatu Isa Chiroma officially congratulated Governor Wiki for making it a dream come true. Among so many dignitaries who um, graced the occasion in Port Harcourt today, uh, Dr. Okewali SEN, um, Dr. OCJ Okocha, and among, well, uh, among several other dignitaries as well, is the newest and the pioneer Deputy Director General of the Nigerian Law School, Port Harcourt, who is no other person than um, CU Mozoba Esquire. A little is um, a little will be told about the current DDG of the Port Harcourt campus of uh, Director General, Deputy Director General. He, um, before his appointment, was um, a lecturer in the Abuja campus, or campus rather, of the Nigerian Law School and has been the uh, focal point of every student who ever lands under his tutelage. He, prior to his um, uh, um, appointment to uh, the Nigerian Law School as a lecturer or a teacher, who, of which he popularly refers to himself, and students as well refer to him as Onye Kuzi, and as a meaning teacher, was a practicing legal practitioner in Port Harcourt, and it is and it seems that uh, this is a homecoming for him as he is being taken back to where he began some years ago as a new week in the Nigeria legal atmosphere, legal terrain. I think um, he should be elated because he, it's a homecoming for him. Thank you, thank you, thank you. <laughs> I'm, I'm just, I'm, I, I, my mouth can't really see what I'm seeing. But thank you, thank you. You can see the magnificent FDFs in this video. If you like this video, leave a comment, hit the subscribe button, and also hit the like button. Thank you.